That's the Millennium Falcon, right? No, it's not, actually. We have to go through the entire hangar in order to find the Millennium Falcon, of course. It's not just as easy as going to Hangar 94. Of course, in a hangar, there would only be one ship. Oi. I believe this is the second to last level. This, I believe this is the last level before the asteroid field. So it's the second to last level before we get to the Death Star. But this one is... is yeah, look. There's the Millennium Falcon, but we can't just go to it, of course. We gotta go around the entire hangar. And we got these sons of bitches that we now have to deal with. Okay, I thought you were gonna push us into that blaster thing. Like, we can't even destroy these enemies. That's the worst part. Plus, we have lasers up above. Oh, that was almost perfect timing, too, pointing out those lasers. Oh, shoot. I missed out on a goodie. Because there's something down there. As far as I remember. And I almost got it, but... Whoa! Stormtrooper out of nowhere. That's the worst thing about this game. Like, you don't even have any real way to tell where a Stormtrooper is, because... Well, they just come out of nowhere. Well, screw the goodies. We're, like, right at the Millennium Falcon. Let's do this. Come on, kill that stormtrooper. Doesn't even look like it didn't even look like it was it was hitting the wall. Oh, fortunately, you grab onto ladders automatically too. That makes things so much easier. Shoot! There we go, and I believe this is the last thing that we have to pass before the Millennium Falcon. Yeah, there we go, Millennium Falcon. Let's get out of this place. Chewie, get us out of here. <laughs> I can't do a Chewbacca sound. Anyway, for this, go to the bottom left or bottom right's hand of the corner and just uh, lean back and relax. You will not be hit at all. Like, like <laughs> my hands are completely off the keyboard. I'm sitting back. My hands are behind my head. Oh, uh, we have gotten past, I believe, like, the first half of the game or something like that. And we still have the cantina music playing, I just realized that. Oh, we've actually gotten pretty far. I thought I wasn't even gonna get past, uh, Tatooine. I know, I know, though, that I probably will not be able to save the princess in this marathon. It's a crying shame, but oh well. I tried my best. <laughs> like, really, this is just like five minutes of just sitting back and relaxing. Which is such a nice change from the stress of losing Han Solo. The traumatic... The traumatic despair of losing Han Solo. And... We got probably the coolest theme in the game. As far as I know. Oh, <laughs> escorting us at gunpoint, I see. That's the one thing I really do like. That there isn't, um... A huge hitbox for these stormtroopers. So you can, like, walk right in front of them. Like I was earlier. Not as close as I was with that guy. But you can walk pretty much touching them. And not be hurt by them. That's the one thing that makes... Oh, I love these ships. That's the one thing that makes it okay that... They appear so quickly. I don't know what this ship is. I've never seen it in any type of Star Wars. Oh wait, is that like the the landing ship from like uh, Return of the Jedi? Because what it looks like is it looks like a Gamorrean face or Gamorrean. You guys know what what race I'm talking about? Like the 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 guards from Jabba's palace. So basically, with this guy, just avoid him. You you can't. You can't hurt this guy, but you can get some help on the way up. Actually, is there anything over here? No, okay. You can't hurt those guys, as far as I can tell. Oh, shooting three blaster bolts now, huh? Getting fancy? Actually, you know what? I bet you we can hit you. No, we can't. And we can't swing the lightsaber in the air, either, which makes so much sense. Anyway, we're 44% through. 
just lost Han Solo. <laughs> oh, oh, here we go. Come on. Oh, crap. I forgot about you. Again, name of the game is just take your time. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Fortunately, if you fall, you can use, you can fall back into these things to try and not take damage, but I kind of screwed it up there. Leap of faith! There we go. Alright, and... No, we're not to the cell block. Oh, cell block yet. We're still a ways away, but we're getting there. We're getting there. Oh, damn it. Alright, one second, guys. This is another thing that I'm gonna... Oh, I am going to need a map for. Alright, so a maze of elevators, but in take, instead of taking an elevator, go straight ahead and get in the door where you must get to the end and enter that other door. Alright, so we're not going to go through any elevators, because this is a maze of elevators that I just don't want to deal with. By the way... Oh, crap, I forgot. Can we not kill you? No, we can't. Alright, so go through this door. Ooh. Damn, I'm doing good. Damn, son. Alright, so... Make our way through here. Oh, I was gonna be like... Oh, tell me those things don't hurt us again. That would be so great if they didn't fire at us another time. Alright, so this is... Okay, we found the computer outlet. Sir? Uh, this is where R2-D2... Uh, finds out that the princess is about to be executed. And now we gotta go find the princess. Alright, so... Let's see. Now go to the maze again and find the tractor beam reactor and destroy it. Oh, you're a son of a bitch. You know, it would be nice if the guy I'm using actually helped me to figure out where I'm supposed to go. <laughs> I like how this guy is saying, if you have five or less continues, start playing the funeral music. You need at least seven or more to get past this. We're not doing bad. All right, so let's see. Tatooine. All right, so nobody actually is going to tell me how to get through this maze. Sons of bitches they are. We're good, we're good. Let's just make your way through the Death Star elevator maze. It's the most bullshit answer I've ever heard. I don't remember how to get through this, so this is going to be me just screaming and kicking for probably like half an hour. Um... This is a, just a bullshit maze. I should probably not pick that up and waited until later. Yeah, see, like, I know we have to get up there later. And this is actually a way to get back to those areas if you fall. But for right now, I have no idea where we're supposed to go. Wait, that's not all. What's over here? That goes down. We're not going to take that, even though I think that's the way we want to go. It is the only way we can go. Please tell me this elevator maze is as complicated as I remember it being as a kid. Because if it's not, I'm just going to hate my, my childhood self because I'm a dumbass. Oh, God. That's the way we came in. God damn it. So this is the way we came in. So we just completely went around in a circle. There's no- what? This just leads us around in a circle. Oh no, there's that- no, there's no elevator over here. Where are we supposed to go? That leads down. This leads up, but- 
Oh, wait, wait, wait. That was probably a bad idea, but that's the only way I can think of to get out of that circle. Because at least now we can do something. Oh! Damn. There's no way for me to dodge that. Oh, man. I what I would do for a health pickup. But I wasted that other one, god damn it. Alright, just wait for the stormtrooper. Take him out. Good, we're good. Maybe this guy was not being a dick when he said, if you don't have more than five continues, you are doomed to a life of failure. Alright, no, we're going the right way. But you gotta dodge this guy, god damn it. Shoot. One continue. Let's make 50%. Come on. Come on, we can do this. 50%. Yeah. Alright, let's see. Now we want to go up here. And... Where is it? We want to drop down here. I don't care if that just hurt me like that. Um... I don't know what else to do. <laughs> Alright, and there's a stormtrooper over here. We're gonna take him out. Good. Go up. There's another stormtrooper. Take him out. Good. I don't believe there's a stormtrooper up here, so we'll just run right through. Alright, and we take this one up, and there'll be the blaster cannon right there. I don't care, I'll take those two hits. I have to. Because I've got health pickup right here. And this should take us up to where we need to go. Which I don't even believe this is the princess yet. I believe this is the tractor beam that we're destroying. <sighs> Fortunately, we can make that jump. I forgot about that. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, good, we're good, we're good. We've still got to take those blaster bolts, though. Damn. I don't know any way to take out the sentry turrets, that's the problem. If there was a way, it wouldn't be a big problem at all, because then I could just be like, boom, you're... Whoa, you're dead. I almost ran off right off the edge. That would have been something that screwed me over. Alright, well, we're screwed. Uh, if we fall again, I'm gonna have to get that other health pickup, which should have respawned because we got a game over. Alright, precise jumps time. Oh, we made it. Perfect. Um... Okay, I wasn't sure if there was a soldier or a blaster turret over here. I believe it's... Pretty much straightforward until we get to the tractor beam room from here. Oh, soldier. Well, stormtrooper, not just a soldier. <laughs> <sighs> there we go, that's the tractor beam room as far as I can remember. Jump! No! We missed out on health. Damn. And we took damage, that's the worst part. Oh, hey, there's health. Oh god, we gotta do this all over again. Alright. Leap of faith! Take the damage, take the damage. I don't care, it's better than not knowing where I'm going and taking all that other damage. So we're gonna be back down to like, two health again. Damn. I forgot how tough this was. Like, it's not tough, it's just tedious. Whoa. Keep almost running off that platform because I forget it's there. <sighs> okay, that's okay. We've got two more lives. I forgot about that. I'm like, oh no, we're screwed if we even die once. We've got two more lives, then we've got another continue. So we're not we're not even screwed. At least we know exactly where we have to go this time. That's right, Luke. Just go right in there. Uh, one more up, I think? No, no, we were good, we were good. Shoot. Go down, don't take that health pickup, we can save that for later. 
So what are you guys' experience with Star Wars games? Because I know a lot of people have played the Super Star Wars games. I don't know how many people have played Shadows of the Empire, stuff like that. As far as I know, not a lot of people have played this game. Um... Whoa. And a lot of people have played Knights of the Old Republic, but... Like, I really don't know what people play for Star Wars games, I just know that I like them. <laughs> because they're, I think they're pretty good. Like, even this, I think, is pretty good for a Game Boy game. I mean, it's really tough, but and it's it, at points it's really unfair. But, like, the controls are really tight, for the most part, except for that lightsaber control. Um... The music's, I think, really good. Like, it's kind of repetitive after a while. Oh, shoot. Yeah, by the way, if you fall far enough, you will actually just die on impact. <laughs> it's pretty funny, though, because he dies like the enemies will die. He'll just disappear in a white flash from falling damage, which is pretty, pretty entertaining. Uh, well... I keep forgetting that pit's there. <laughs> That's the funniest thing. Whee! Okay. Alright, let's do this. We can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Alright. Whee! Whee! Uh, damn it. It's that last jump keep taking it half a second too soon. I don't know why. So apparently, I don't know if we're going to get this far enough. Far, so I'm going to talk about it now. I've been looking at this uh, instruction guide because, you know, I had to look it up to make sure that I was going the right way in this maze because I was hoping that Maybe someone would be nice enough to be like, Oh, you take this door and it solves all your problems. But no. Nobody did that. Um, but I've been looking through the thing, and you know how I said I've never gotten past the snake beast and the compressor or whatever, it's, whatever it is? Apparently what you have to do is hit it with your lightsaber a single time. Oh gosh, we almost screwed ourselves because I almost jumped half a second too late. Or too early. There we go, finally. Oh my god. 